Ogling just got dangerous. Foursquare checks in at a billion. And name that baby. Welcome to Online Out of Line. LOL. Like, are you online? You're so Facebook me, bro. It's so Hey, I'm Joshua Swanson. And I'm Lauren Gilmore. Thought you could Google anyone without any consequences? Well, think again. Heidi Bloom tops the list for the most dangerous celeb on the web. Wait, 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 wait. How could she be dangerous? Have you seen what she looks like? According to McAfee, using Clume's name and qualifiers such as hot pictures, screen savers, and free downloads yield a nearly 1 in 10 chance of landing you on a malicious site. Leave off hot pictures when searching for Heidi Klum. Other celebs that computer hackers have taken a liking to include Scarlett Johansson, Brad Pitt, Lauren Gilmore, and Emma Stone. Did, did you just say your own name? Did, did you just write that down? The company Color has launched a new app that's actually pretty sweet. You remember them? Not really. Well, they're the company that raised $41 million and created a photo app that no one understood. CEO Bill Wen feels like they've learned from their mistakes. We really believed from the very beginning of Color that, that the post-PC world was going to change how social activity worked. How can you build a social network on top of a social network? Which is, we learned that you can build an amazing social experience. Huh. I wonder why no one understood the first app. He makes so much sense. Doesn't he? Well, the good news is that we actually understand his new app. It has a cool feature that allows you to host a virtual visit on Facebook. You invite your friends and they'll see the world through your camera phone all in real time. So if you're walking the streets of Paris, skiing the Swiss Alps, or becoming the first person to eat 10 saltines and chug a gallon of milk, you'll never again have to say you should have been there. But saltines and milk? What are you talking about? You never tried that in college? No, we were too busy studying and becoming responsible members of society. Oh, that sounds fun. Lindsay and Dave, a couple from Chicago, are expecting their second daughter and can't seem to decide on a name. So they've turned to Facebook and said, let the people decide. You can vote by going to namemychild.info, but there are only four names to choose from. The parents feared that a free-for-all would result in the child being named Apple, Bambi, or my dad's a pussy for doing this poll instead of standing up to my mom. The Motion Picture Academy is clamping down on its members by banning all negative campaigning on social networks. A member isn't supposed to badmouth someone else's movie on Twitter, Facebook, or any other social network. So that means we won't see any tweets about the following movies. Abduction, Green Lantern, Something Borrowed, and I don't know how she does it. Foursquare hit 100 million check-ins just 14 months ago, and now they've surpassed the truly impressive 1 billion mark. The continuous surge in the service's popularity makes Foursquare a powerful marketing opportunity. Marketers will make money off of you because you checked in and became mayor of the supply closet. <laughs> oh, wait, I don't get it. I, I don't, why, were they gonna try and sell you ink cartridges every time you go into the supply closet or something? I don't. Yes. Oh, right. Yeah, that's really smart. Thanks for watching Online Out of Line. I'm Lauren Gilmore. And I'm Joshua Swanson on top of Joshua Swanson inside a social network that's named Joshua Swanson. Makes sense.